Hello and welcome to episode 18 of Having Fun Playing on Awake. I don't know why that title for this is so long, but I'll have to change it at some time. The dark presence followed the choreography laid out to it in the manuscript, growing stronger and stronger, moving like a storm from one scene of destruction to the next. But it was still bound to follow the story and chained to the dark place it came from. When the story reached the end it longed for, it would finally be free. I think I actually had that one read before, but I wasn't sure, so I'm just gonna reread it. So when this story is over, the dark person is gonna be free. I wonder what that means. Is it then just going to be free free, or is it going to disappear free? Oh, the cabin. That's a thermo. Here's darkness. It's a manuscript page. I'm gonna turn this off. On. Because in darkness, like, in darkness like this, I'm never safe. Oh, that's a shotgun. The storm raged on as the Anderson brothers walked unsteadily away from the clinic with the other patients in tow. Knowing that this time they wouldn't return, the darkness around them seethed with horrors, but Tor and Odin were unafraid. Their eyes glinted with guile. They knew every secret path, and there was blood on their hands. They had fought these shades before. I wonder what that role in this is. Someone had left a gun behind. Now I had a fighting chance of reaching the farm. Thank you. Thank you, game. I appreciate that very, very much. I guess I'll have to get inside here. Oh, come on! Wait, what? What just happened to him? How did he just... Did he just get electrocuted out of nowhere? Okay... Weird... Anyways, due to the, the quality of the last couple of episodes... I, I'm gonna try and upgrade it a little. I tried making sure that you won't hear as much breathing sounds in these episodes. I hope that works out. I doubt it, but I hope it. And then I'm trying to make them longer. About 25 minutes each. Those short episodes aren't so fun. Yay! Taken! Whoa! Got you. I still have no clue where I'm going, so I'm just gonna follow the road. Wait, where did you come from? I know you're there. Okay, why aren't you dying from one shot anymore? Um. Okay, they just keep on coming. Oh well, at least I got an achievement out of that. Um. Yeah, I'm sorry for dying a lot, but. This is actually quite difficult. Considering I want to save some ammo and get through this. Get away from me. I'm actually gonna get close and kill it. Oh, come on. Of course, that had to call enemies.
there. Two down. Jeez. Okay, that's two more down. I don't care. I'm just gonna get into the light. Phew. I could see the car, but there was no sight of the driver. I believe he's inside. Inside the dark house. Hello? Anybody here? Ah! Barry! Ah! Ah! No! Danny! You're not! Ah! Please! Ah! 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 What are you? What are you? Ah! No! Don't! I'm sorry! Ah! 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 What the? I know you. You were in jail the other day. I went to the farm again for the moonshine, you know? It makes you see. They're, they're not gonna miss it. They're in the loony bin. Okay. I run through every possible course in my head. If I continue like the Dark Presence wants me to, the story I'm writing won't save Alice. It's a horror story. It is going to kill her, and me, and everybody in this town. No one will survive. Darkness will consume everything. This is what it's wanted all along. It will be free, unstoppable. It used Alice to get to me, dangled her in front of me to keep me going. It was never going to release her. I'm going to change this. I'll escape. I've written myself into the story. I'm now the protagonist. This feels like a terrible risk, but it's the only way to save Alice. I'll be bound by the events of the story just as much as anyone else who's been woven into it. The story must stay true for this to work. There have to be victims along the way, near escapes, cliffhangers. In a horror story, it can't be certain that the hero will succeed or even survive. He almost has to die. I'll write my own escape into the story next. I need help. Zane's going to be the one who will help me. I'll make it happen. So I did write the story that which everything is doing, and I actually did try and save myself. Let me guess, Danny, huh? Yeah, I think that was Danny. Oh, I almost missed the thermo. We can't have that. I think that was 41 or something like that. I guess this door's the locked. The front door was locked. I could climb out through the broken window. The farm was still a good distance away. I'd need a car to get there fast. Good thing there is a car, but I'm just gonna search the area for extra ammunition. If Barry wasn't up here, he was probably in trouble down at the farm. For a moment, I felt bad for doubting him. After all, I made it this far myself. Oh. But Barry was Barry. Yeah, you made it far, but I think he can take care of himself. He seems pretty capable. At least on adrenaline, everyone can do some things. That's not bad. I mean, maybe he can do it too. Okay, I'm just gonna check the watchtower. Oh, here's a streak of stash. Yeah, I know the dog is gonna attack me, but that's no new thing. Still. Yeah, that's a stash. I need to find it. Okay, the heavy breathing is kinda unnerving. Stopped. Huh. The 
heavy breathing stopped. Okay, still here. That is creepy as hell. I'm just gonna borrow this car. I wonder what the difference in the car... Oh god, I just thought that was something attacking me. Jeez, I'm being way too afraid. Okay, so what can we find up here? Probably a manuscript page. Is that is that a hunting rifle? Well, as I'm sure everyone's noticed, that storm we all felt coming is finally here. The boys at the weather service reckon it'll last until morning at the very least. Sheriff's Department still looking for a Caucasian woman, 30 years old, slim and blonde with blue eyes. She may be lost in the woods, and it's possible she's been injured in a car accident. If you see her, please make sure you get her indoors and call the sheriff. It's bad weather to be caught out in, so if you see someone in the area who maybe looks a little confused, give him a hand, all right? <clears throat> this is Pat Main on KBF. I guess that's... Okay. I guess that's um, Alice. What are you? Oh, big guy. Very big guy. And a headshot. I think I'll just sk switch cars again. Almost too convenient to place. Th oh, that was the wrong way around. Oh well, I guess I can do. I mean, it's not like I'm gonna ditch the car in 15 minutes. Wait, is this? No, I thought I thought it was dying on the road. I guess just dirt. Whoa! What was? Jeez, what was that? I don't know if that works, but I just want them out of my way. What? He's still standing! Oh, I almost hit a tree. I don't think I can... No, I can't take this way up. Not this way, this thing up. Okay, I guess I'll just have to go through the broken fence. On foot. I did get some flashbangs, so I guess it's not that bad. Whoa, no, no, no. I wonder if I can stop this with a regular flip. Whoa, that actually worked! I'm impressed. Um, uh, I'm worried that the cars are gonna get up and kill me. Um, I guess I will have to go through the fence here. It's just kind of a point of no return. I don't like those. Oh, can I get inside here? No, I can't. Well, I am taking the at the farm, I guess, but... Oh, here's a secret stash. Um, 
in here. I can hear you breathing. It's not me this time. Uh, okay, so let's give switch to the revolver. I keep trying to mix in danger. Oh, okay. That's a big guy. Yeah, take a flare. I know you hate them. Come on. Huh, that wasn't so hard. Still, it isn't my heavy breathing. I'd known the brothers used to be some kind of rock stars. But it hadn't really sunk in until I saw the stage. Yeah, I think I know where this is going. Run! They're coming! There's too many of them! Whoa! Badass! gonna grab some ammo. Lateral carnage. Stuff's really going down. I think I was an achievement about not getting to look. Well, I kind of failed that, anyways. Um, <laughs> without getting to look health. Holy shit! Whoa! Pump action shotgun! Come on, give me!
Jeez, why do I do it die so easily? Um, okay. Give me the pump action shotgun. Come on. Um, yeah, guys, that's a party in the USA! Something like that. Well, that's a terrible song. Never mind. Whoa! Take grenades! Take it, suckers! Flashbang! Grenade! Woo! Or something like that. Lol, that was extreme. Indeed it was. Rock and roll capital of America. That was awesome on so many levels game. I I I have to say that was probably the best experience I ha I've ever had. This way to the farm. God damn it that was awesome. Awesome beyond belief. Guys, that was the epic finish for this episode. I hope you really enjoyed it because I so did. Anyways, thanks for watching.